Hello everyone, welcome back to Simulate Heaven, and I got a new game. <laughs> I say that a lot, don't I? UAZ Racing 4x4. Now, a long time ago, a few years ago, for some reason I bought a 1C complete pack. 1C are a gaming company, allegedly. I mean, they make games. And I got this 1C pack on Gamersgate a long time ago because it was really, really cheap. And it had loads of games in it, and it did have some all-white games as part of the pack. Anyway, I've made my ex excuses, but anyway, I did um, get this game, UAZ Racing 4x4. And it's it's an interesting game. I wouldn't... I don't know. Well, we'll see, won't we? But, yeah. Not a bad game. I wouldn't recommend actually going out and buying it, unless it's very, very cheap. But when I tried it, I was kind of pleasantly surprised that it's not completely awful. Anyway, we're going to do a championship. I'm going to see how this championship goes. So you can apparently choose areas, although because it's the beginning, I can only choose this area here, Midland Russia. So I click on that. Resume. Okay, I can choose Forest, Marathon, Sprint. Why is that green? What does that mean if it's green? Baptism by Fire. Okay, am I... Am, oh, we, oh, the green one is the one you've selected. Oh, so what does that mean? This is something about gears, whatever that means. A trial. This is like 4x4, four four, it says, race. I don't know. I have no idea. Let's go to the garage. This is my vehicle. Um, it's okay, isn't it? Not bad. You can repair it. You can tune it. You can look at the cars in, in the dealership. I can't afford any of these cars because I spent my money already. So, there's some interesting cars as part of the game. As you can see, they're all like the Russian cars, you know. I believe. Although, is that... Yeah, mm, I don't know. Whatever. They look more like Chinese cars to me. You know, like when China makes kind of, you know, their own versions of cars that look like Western cars. Anyway. So I can't afford to buy any of those. So let's get out of here. Just I'd show you some of the cars in the game. Right, you can do tuning, but I can't do any tuning because you need the bonus points. I have no boin bonus points right now. None. So, as you can see, I need 1,800 bonus points to unlock that. 900. 2,160. So, let's face it, there's not much that I can upgrade. Repair. I don't think my thing... I don't think my truck... It's damaged. No, it's not. That's good. Okay, so there you go. You've seen the amazing stuff available in this game. So let's do Chasing Luck Trophy. Okay. Trophy is a complex discipline. You must drive through all checkpoints in a set sequence. You're free to choose your way, though. The time it takes you to complete the whole track will affect your final place. Okie dokie. So it seems like you get... Mm, money and rating points if you're able to finish in the top three places okay let's start we are loading so as you can tell this is a Russian game which is not a bad thing it says the game's not responding it is now Right, so you see, there I am. I'm, I'm up against three other guys. I don't think you actually see them. It's a bit like a, a time trial kind of thing. Let's go. Let's off-road. Oh, already. I failed already. Okay, let's do that again. Oh, there's a ghost car. Wait, escape, restart. <laughs> that was that was just a test run. That was just a test run, just to make sure the car was working. <laughs> let's go, let's off-road. Right, now 
you know, it's quite a bumpy track. The handling is pretty weird, like, as you see, you almost have to predict what, you, where, what you're going to be doing, you know? In order to, to, you know, in order for you to slow down in time. Now, you can see I have a compass in the top left. The red marker is telling me the direction my next waypoint is. We're going across some bridges. I mean, the graphics are not bad. They're not brilliant. They're, they are pretty basic, pretty old school, but they work, kind of. You've got hot air balloons and stuff. That guy seems a lot faster than me, doesn't he? It's kind of handy having that guy because I can see where he's going. Whee! Let's, let's try a different view. Oh, there you go. Oh, we're going through like that bit. With like trees and stuff. Whoa, bumpy. We've got windscreen wipers. That'll definitely help. Yeah, it definitely helps having that guy because the ghost guy ahead of me, I mean, because I can see where he goes and follow him. Come on, we need more power. He's getting away. Damn it. He's getting away. Yeah, that does. See? Oh, my goodness. That was not a good turn. You kind of have to break a lot. I am using the Xbox 360 controller just to let you know. Did I go the wrong way there? I think I did. Did I go the wrong way? Maybe I did. Or maybe I didn't. I can't see the road. This is not good. Uh, are we lost? Am I going the right way? Not sure. I think I'm alright actually. Yeah, I'm kind of okay. Kind of, barely. And my car is kind of dented. Somewhat. Anyway. We're, we're, we're kind of doing it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, 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 dude. Hey, let's try an outside view. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, let's try an outside view. Our, our truck is very, very, very muddy. Very broken, very, you know, worse for wear, as you'd expect, because I'm driving it. Whoa, 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 I can't see where I'm going on that bit. At all. To be fair, I think this game is quite old. It's at least, I reckon, about three or four years old. I've At least, maybe more. So, it's not really a modern game, so you can't really expect it to be, like, up there. I always get confused because the red marker... Am I going the wrong way now? Oh, I think I might be. I'm not really sure if I'm supposed to be going off-road, you know, more off-road, to do shortcuts and stuff. And I can't see what I'm doing. Like, that is the one good thing with inside. The inside view. Whoa, 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 whoa. Come on, we're going to do this. Is it... Oh, no, it's straight ahead, see? You're supposed to go straight ahead. See, I suppose that's something you could do. Whoa, 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 whoa. You could actually just totally... Uh, drive like a madman to the red markers I suppose without without a care in the world and I'm gonna have to break here somewhat I reckon he's going left the ghost man let's follow the ghost man of course I mean the handling and all that it's it's not that Realistic. I don't know. It's kind of hard, really, to tell when you're using an Xbox 360 controller. Oh, there's a tractor. Hello, tractor. And there's lots of hot air balloons. And there's lots of trees just appearing as if by magic before my eyes. Awesome. I bet there's a hard turn. Is there? No, there's not. Alright, down this way. Am I supposed to go down there? No, I'm not. 
That was a bonus point. Is it trying to trick me? You know what? Can I go there? No, I can't. So, oh my goodness. I probably just lost, like, so much time there. It's just, I don't know the track. It's very confusing to know where you have to go. I don't think I'm going to be finishing in the top three, guys. I don't know. Not, it's not looking very lightly, is it, frankly? Is it up here? No. <laughs> I was just driving into someone's house. Randomly. Sorry, mate. Didn't mean to do that. Didn't mean to drive into your house randomly. Now, this view helps you to see where you are supposed to be driving, I suppose. Which, you know, kind of helps. Yay, finish line. Ooh, did we finish second? Why at Cuba? Why am I called Cuba? Is that me? I'm highlighted yellow. Why am I called Cuba? No, hang on. Why am I called Cuba anyway? I, I don't know. Did I get points for that? I think that's me. But why am I called Cuba? I'll say that again if you want. Okay, so I... Oh, I earned 4,570. I'm rich. Yay! I got four rating points and I got 150 bonus points. Save the replay? Really? There's a replay? Okay, let's watch the replay. This should be funny. Come on then. There I am. Yay! Let's off road. Look at me inside there. Yay! Orbiting cam. What is an orbiting cam? Oh, there I go, look. Yeah, so, you know, it's quite a basic game. You know, not really a, a simulator game, kind of. Um, I suppose it's kind of fun, but I suppose because it's a little bit old now, you wouldn't, most people wouldn't be like, oh, I really want to play that UAZ 4x4 racing game. You know, it's like if you accidentally own it like I did by buying the complete 1C pack a long time ago, you know, it's 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 not bad for laughs. Uh, but I wouldn't say, and this is the hilarious thing, I looked it up on Gamersgate and it's on the actual price for it right now on Gamersgate is 29.99 US, which is crazy, but I don't even know if it's still available on Gamersgate. I was trying to like search for it on Gamersgate like normally and I couldn't find the game I actually had to go into my list of games and like access the store page via that so maybe the game is not available anymore I don't know but anyway I'm sure you enjoyed this amazing episode of UAZ 4x4 racing I think I'll do a few more um, I probably won't do the whole thing, but, um, you know, the whole championship. But, you know, I'll do at least a few episodes for a laugh. Thanks for watching. I hope you had a laugh and see you in the next one. Bye-bye.